Raven's home, and we are in her closet. Yes. Okay, let's just let's jump right in because fashion was such a big part of That's So Raven. Yes, Raven Baxter is back, and only E.T. got a peek inside the Raven's home wardrobe department, where we learned Raven is still totally Raven. Mom? Oh, snap! This is still Raven Baxter. She's still a fashion designer. Her personal style and the style of her kids is very important, but what we love is creating. We love taking pieces out of the store and putting things together. So one of the pieces that you're gonna be seeing throughout the entire season and show <laughs> are, I'm gonna call them tricked out onesies. <laughs> Everybody needs a good onesie with a butt pad. Um, let's keep going, right? Another piece that we have, which is actually a piece that you yourself can find, which is really cool, but the way we changed it is we cut the sides and it kind of brings back what Raven Baxter used to do a lot in that. So Raven, which was a lot of embroidery. So we're bringing it up to, you know, the mother version of Raven <laughs> Baxter. Mom, the weirdest thing happened. It's not always about you, Booker. <laughs> How would you say Raven's style has changed as a mom? It's a lot sleeker, clean lines, not so much Bam! <laughs> it's more like, bam. You know, ah, that's the best way I can explain it. The sophisticated bam. It's a sophisticated, instead of just salt, it's truffle salt. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I see. You get I it. see. Okay. We've stepped up our game a little bit. <laughs> just check out these shoes. So, with Raven Baxter on That's So Raven, I wore heels almost every episode. A girl got smart and stopped wearing heels. <laughs> So now we have a really fun collection of flat sneakers and also some gems in there from an old co-star of mine, Miss Whoopi Goldberg. She blessed me with some amazing shoes. Your motherly instinct has kicked in playing a mom on TV. Has that been weird for you? It has, <laughs> okay, weird isn't the right word for me. I love it, I've always wanted to be a mother. I'm still looking forward to that day when I can, but I was trying my hardest to be as motherly as I can, but we also have a job to do. So it's a little bit of, Mama jurying, I guess. <laughs> a little bit of everything because this is still a job. We're having fun, but we have a job to do and we have to get this show on the road. So, other than being a mom, how would you say Raven has changed the character in 10 years? Um, Raven Baxter has not changed. I think Raven Baxter is still that fun, kooky, crazy, down for whatever, here for friends girl. And still having psychic visions. Always! <laughs> Never going away! And one of her kids has psychic vision, so we're all good. We're all good. Can you give us the best psychic vision look to the camera? <laughs> there it is. What I did you see? I had a vision that I was in the bathroom. <laughs> All right, so we've seen Raven's closet. Now it's time to see Chelsea's. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Gosh, fancy meeting you here, Bryce. I mean, we're in Chelsea's closet. It's kind of fabulous. I think Chelsea's kind of dealing with um, this, her storyline being that she was really rich, you know, and um, is sort of not anymore and kind of living with Raven because of financial difficulties. So, ah. Yeah, so it's interesting to see her kind of wear her house clothes that might be a nicer brand that she's kind of, you know, not able to actually go out and buy. Anymore. I see. <laughs> it's very mom chic. Very mom chic. Yes, that's good. Very smart. I like being an only child. There's never a question of favoritists. <laughs> <laughs> it's me, right? Looking at Chelsea's style, it's a little toned down from the Chelsea we knew on That's So Raven. I guess. I think I was wearing like a lot of corduroy back then. <laughs> but of course, I'm a mom now. I'm a parent. I have right. to tone it down. You're, you're right. Other than being a mom, how has Chelsea changed in the 10 years since we last saw her? I think she's gone through a lot of life experiences. I think that'll play a little bit into um, Chelsea, who's last name is different now and I can't really say. Oh. I know. If you want to borrow anything, Bryce, you're more than welcome. You know to. I would, I just don't think I, it will fit. Okay, okay, no worries, yeah. no worries. Um, we can do a costume fitting or something. 